Ndiri mzimai ano shisenze la ariega. Yo soy una mujer de negocios. Ana Sayyidat Amal. I'm a businesswoman and welcome to the international marketplace. Candles, art, necklaces, crafts and food are but few of the items you'll find at the international marketplace. Started in 2004 by the Immigrant Women's Center in Hamilton, Ontario, the International Marketplace was born out of the need to encourage immigrants and refugee women in their business goals and capacity. Uh, it's the Immigrant Women's uh, uh, annual project to fundraise, but mostly to give opportunities to other women that have a business, that want to launch a business, that have a concept, that wants to uh, try out, you know, uh, uh, something that they make at home or something that they uh, import from back home, ideas, and they, they dream of having uh, extra money, right? And uh, dream of uh, opening a business, and you know, we all do. When women are, um, uh, especially immigrating to other countries, right, we are looking for a space for us. So these women here have a space. Okay, my name is Salvina Mwendo and uh, I am at the International Marketplace because I'm here to sell my products. All these products are made by the women from my village in Kenya, Kisi. So we're here to promote them and uh, look for markets for the product. For me, it's helping me connect to my home. So. It's um, when I touch the soap zone, I connect straight to my village. Honestly, I, I feel like I'm home when I sell this product. So it takes away my loneliness when I miss home. So uh, also it's helping me to give back and true giving comes from the heart. So this is really, this is true satisfaction. What I do gives me true satisfaction. I look forward to this every year because I think it's amazing and to see such powerful women who are so resilient to and so creative, so artistic, it's just so exciting to come and get your Christmas shopping done and to be able to help empower women. Yeah, and to see women who didn't feel, who didn't know that they had these gifts to offer and they do, they have so many gifts to offer and what the work they do and how they still support uh, families from their own country still too and I completely I, I love it I love it. it it gives me a great feeling and I love listening to the stories because I I know I'm very privileged growing up in Canada and I hear the stories and it reminds me of my privilege as well so I don't forget um, others in the world so. And, and it's about living in community, right? Yeah. So this is our sisters, our mothers, our friends, yes. you know? So it's, it's, it's an amazing opportunity to come. Yeah. So we're pretty excited that it happens every, every year. year. <laughs>